Hola people, welcome back to my channel, Life Science Fantastic. As per the title, in today's video, I'll be talking about genetic counseling in India. So, what are we waiting for? Let's get started. First of all, let me introduce you all with what or who are genetic counselors. So, so genetic counselors are specialist professionals one can approach for seeking advice in healthcare regarding the genetic and genomic contribution to a particular health condition. They have increasingly becoming an integrated part of healthcare sectors or services because most of the diseases or their treatment plans can be managed well with relevant genetic tests. They have increasingly becoming an integrated part of healthcare sector or services because most of the diseases or their treatment plans can be managed really well with relevant genetic tests and their interpretation. Basically, genetic counselors use the fundamentals of genetics for predicting, assessing and analyzing the risk of genetically inherited disease in individual member of a family and population. They usually work directly with the patients or with healthcare professionals to keep the clients informed about the risk and advantages of their genetics, which is especially important for the couples intending to have their children together. Now, let's talk about the responsibilities of a genetic counselor. So, the responsibilities of a typical genetic counselor involves 1. Managing patient caseloads via face-to-face -face encounters, phone calls and video calls. 2. Collecting and evaluating the family and medical history to determine the likelihood of reoccurrence or incidence of a disease. 3. Determining which genetic testing is best for the patient. 4. Analyzing genetic testing and explaining them to the patients and their families in clear and simple terms. 5. Making parents understand about patterns of hereditary diseases, testing, precautions, resources and research. And 6. Maintaining patient record. Now, if I move ahead and talk about what are the qualifications to become a certified genetic counselor in India, then... In India, the Board of Genetic Counseling, that is BCG, is responsible for regulation of education, training and practice of genetic counseling. Every year, they conduct an exam for certification as a professional genetic counselor. So, the qualifications you need to become a genetic counselor in India include 1. Have completed a recognized genetic counseling course in India or any other country. 2. Have completed a minimum of one year of formal training or an educational course in genetic counseling. 3. Have completed a 12 plus 4 years course in life science subjects such as psychology, medicine, uh, nursing, uh, sociology or any other allied science course like genetics and biotechnology etc. But with a genetic counseling course. And, and 4. Working or worked at least for a minimum of 3 years in genetics or genomics lab to provide results related to counseling patients. <laughs> Now let's move ahead and talk about the institutes offering training and certificate courses in genetic counseling in India. So the in institutes include 1. Certificate course in genetic counseling, Manipal Hospitals, Manipal. 2. DBT that is Department of Biotechnology 1 year PG Diploma at Osmania University, Hyderabad. 3. MSc Biomedical Genetics with Genetic Counseling at VIT. 4. MSc in Genetic Counseling at Nizam's Institute of Medical Sciences, Hyderabad. 5. PG Certificate Course in Medical and Genetic Counseling, Kamineni Hospital, Hyderabad. And 6. MSc Genetic Counseling at Kasturba Medical College, Manipal. Other than these 6 courses, there are 2 more courses available for Genetic Counseling in India. But one needs an in, uh, internship immediately after the course because to validate the certificate. So that includes 1. Certificate Course of Genetic Counseling, IMA and 2nd. Professional Certificate in Genetic Counseling at Future Medicine Academy and Sri Ramachandra Medical Institute. 
to be very very honest genetic counseling is gaining momentum in india with the raising awareness about genetic disorders and hereditary diseases it is definitely a career path worth pursuing i guess that's it for today guys hope you like the video if you like it do share it with all the students who need this kind of information and i'll see you in my next one bye bye guys toodles